Before we start shooting, Mr. Wood, uh, uh, we have a few questions. Yes, uh, the script contains numerous references to grave robbing. Now, we find the concept of digging up consecrated ground to be highly offensive. It is blasphemy. What are you talking about? It's the premise of the movie. It's the title of the movie, for Christ's sake. <laughs> Mr. Wood! Uh, yes, about that title. Uh, it strikes us as very inflammatory. Uh, why don't we change it to Plan 9 from Outer Space? Huh. <laughs> That's ridiculous. All right. And action! Mythical examiner, been around yet? Just left. Oh, the morgue wagon ought to be along most any time. You get their statement? Yeah, but they're pretty scared. Fine mess like this, I'll frighten anyone. You have one of the boys uh, take the guy and the girl back to town. You take charge. What you give him all the lines for? He's unintelligible. Look, Lugosi's dead and Vampiro won't talk. I had to give somebody the dialogue. That is no answer. What about glitter? When I was a headliner in Paris, audiences always liked it when I sparkled. No. Cat's eyes. No. Well, I'm going to need some antennae. No, you're the ruler of the galaxy. Show a little taste. See, no talking. Isn't he good? Cue Dr. Tom. So now? Yes, now. Lurk him. Be sure and keep your face covered. Bella lives. It doesn't distract you as a bit morbid? No, he would have loved it. Bella's returned from the grave. Just like Dracula. You vampire. Let's go down and find out whose grave it is. Oh, why do I always get hooked up with these spook details? Monsters, graves, bodies. You flying saucer? And cut, Brent. We're moving on. That was perfect. Perfect. Uh, Mr. Wood, do you know anything about the art of film production? Well, I like to think so. That cardboard headstone tipped over. The, this graveyard is obviously phony. Nobody will ever notice that. Filmmaking is not about the tiny details. It's about the big picture. The big picture? Yes. Then how about when the policeman arrived in daylight, but now it's suddenly night? What do you know? Haven't you heard of suspension of disbelief? Reverend, I'm here. <laughs> <laughs> Who is he? This is our choir director. He's going to play the young hero. Are you people insane? I'm the director. I make the casting decisions around here. I thought this was a group effort. No! No. They're driving me crazy! These Baptists are stupid, stupid, stupid! Okay. I'm gonna calm down. I'm gonna calm down. I'm gonna calm down. Take a deep breath. Relax. All right, everybody, let's get set up for scene 112. Move the crypt stage left and let's get Tor's makeup effect ready. Mr. Wood, what do you think you're doing? I'm directing. Not like that, you're not. Get up immediately. Shame, oh, Lord. That's it! <laughs> 